shall they be known who are my chosen, yep. and they shall be tried as gold in the fire. Hear, O ye my beloved, saith the Lord, Behold, the days of trouble are at hand, but I will deliver you from the same. Yeah, and like I, I, I go back to that brother Karatza uh, who did that uh that I uh was it I I cast I yeah, podcast podcast the one okay on on this the time we're coming into he was like you brothers need to you need to know these scriptures for yourself man all right because that's what's that's what's gonna have to be in your mind all right and and that's what your mind gonna have to revert back to when all hell break loose. Cause people are gonna lose it, man. They're gonna go crazy. Alright? And if you was faking the front, the Lord gonna take all that knowledge you supposedly had, He's gonna take it away from you and let you get broke down, take the chip and die. So you gotta fear, man. And believe that the Lord gonna deliver you. Keep reading. Uh, be not afraid, neither doubt, for the most high is your guide. Yep. And the guide of them who keep my commandments and precepts, saith the Lord power. So you got to do what the Bible said. The Lord told you, he said, if you, if you do these commandments and teach other men to do them, then you shall be great in the kingdom of heaven. But if you teach people to break even the least commandment, all right, then you are a hypocrite. You're going to be the least in the kingdom, meaning you're going to be destroyed and you're going to be brought back as one of the children of the prophets. Okay, keep reading. Let not your sins weigh you down, yep. and let not let and let not your iniquities lift up themselves. Uh -huh. Woe be to them that are bound with their sins, yep. and covered with their iniquities. Like as a field is covered with the bushes, and the path thereof covered with thorns, that no man may travel there through. Uh -huh. It is left undressed and is cast into the fire to be consumed therewith. Yeah, and get that one in Ecclesiastes, was it chapter 2 where it says, uh, Woe unto them that lost patience. We'll end it on that. No, it's in the Bible. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. I think it's chapter 2 where it says, Woe unto them that lost patience. What you gonna do when the Lord comes for you? I think it's chapter 2 is it chapter 1. No, it's chapter 2. Verses, um, read verse 12 through 14. Sirach chapter 2, verse 12. Woe be to the fearful hearts and faint hands, and the sinner that go up to ways. Yep. Woe unto him that is faint hearted, for he believeth not. Therefore shall he, like, therefore shall he not be defended. Yep. Woe unto you that have lost patience. And what will you do when the Lord shall visit you? Yeah, what 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 is Mahar, Bidya, and, and Bakar gonna do when the Lord visit you? And the word like we got before the word visit means to punish. Unless you got one more script. We'll close it out on that. So destruction to these niggas, man. Alright? That means you sided with Esau, man. You you was with him destroying our people. And you with, with him destroying them in the future. So you're going to be accounted like a heathen. The Lord going to destroy you. Luke chapter 21, verse 19. And your patience possess ye your souls. That's beautiful. That's right. And your patience. And patience means to suffer. So in your sufferings, possess ye your souls. And get that one, uh, uh, Matthew 24, 13, about he that endureth to the end. And endurance is the same thing, it means to suffer. Matthew chapter 24, verse 13. Yeah. But, but he that shall endure unto the end, the same shall be saved. That's right, so for right now, we're not saved. We, we in a good, we in a better opportunity than, than a, another person, than, than other people. But we gotta have that fear and trembling, man, that the Lord, he can remove you, man. And you see that now with these guys are getting sifted out and exposed, man. All right, so if, like the scripture says, it said, let not your sins weigh you down. So if, if you struggling with some, what, what, pray, fast, uh, uh, seek godly counsel, yep. all right? And hope that the Lord will have mercy on you, man, because Satan trying to get brothers out, man. If Satan sifted Peter, 
Who's the top top apostle? All right. How much more us? We not Peter, okay? And Satan is on is is trying to get us. He desired to sin. He, he didn't sin. No, he said, yeah, he's sick. Oh, yeah, he's, he's sick. The Lord said, once, once you're uh, converted, strengthen the brother. All right. So, and the scriptures say that Satan, he desired to uh, to sift you. All right.